Okay, everyone. So I was able to call in or fill out the report for the tie. So I'm not sure. Am I supposed to talk with the police now? Um, I'm not sure. Oh, shoot. I need to give the wife the grocery money, too. Are they waiting for Klaus to return home? I can't talk with the police. Uh, are they just waiting for him to return? I don't know. Do I have to call the... I still have 74 hours. Maybe I need to give her the money. Wait, let me do this. Since I got an hour. Uh, give her the grocery money. Five. Oh, I don't have 500. I thought it was 50. Shoot. Okay, never mind. $500 for groceries? Where are we living? Ugh. Let's call. Um... I think they're waiting for him to come home. I think that's what's happening. Is this them? Oh, <gasps> there they are. There they are. Oh, that's what they're doing. They're waiting. They're waiting. Oh, here he comes. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, they're beating up an old man. That's that's wrong on so many levels. Oh. Well, I'm uh, so sad, but I guess I didn't, I evicted him, but not his wife. His wife went on in. She was like, listen, my name is Ben and I ain't in it. His wife went into the house. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I got some money. So now I got to call in. I got to call this in, right? Let me call this in. Completion. Report. Dial the number. Report the task. Congratulations, your task was a success. For helping to catch a criminal, you were rewarded $3,000. Good job, comrade. Your next, next task is to place propaganda banners in your building. We need to increase patriotism among your tenants. There is unrest in the city. Stay alert, comrade Carl. Whew. I choose violence. I unlocked. I choose violence. <gasps> Look at my people are all sad. Oh, my tenants. Oh, they're all sad. Oh, no, not him. Oh, well, he already. Uh, well, we listen. Oh. Oh, nobody likes me now. Oh. This is this is not good. Everybody's up here. What's happening? Oh, no. Oh, what's going on? Well, let's end this conversation. Something's happening. Oh. Violence is happening. Oh, gosh. What have they done? What is an uh, angry mob is coming through? An angry mob is coming through. Oh. Oh, gosh. Did they, like... Oh, our building needs to be repaired. Oh, gosh. What in the world? What kind of game am I playing? Oh, Maria. Hello. Maria's... Oh, my phone. Oh, my phone is ringing. My phone is ringing. My phone is ringing. Go answer it. I don't have time to talk to you right now. Lady, lady, uh, sir, answer your phone. Answer this phone. Hurry. We cannot not answer the phone now. Not in the middle of civil unrest. Not in the middle of civil unrest. There's unrest in the city. It's dangerous to go outside. Stay calm and repair any every, anything in the house that's broken. You have two days. Are you serious right now? This is too... This is too... Oh, they done tore up everything. 
I don't have no money for this. I got shenanigans. I need to talk to her, apparently. All right, let me knock on the door. Everybody's mad at me. Did I knock on the door? Everybody's mad. Yeah, your husband is, is long gone, lady. I'm sorry. I didn't do any of it. I just happened to manage this place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Talk about husband's arrest. Okay. I don't know what happened. Me either. They just arrived and arrested Klaus. They beat him before dragging him away. Luggage. We've packed everything. Uh, cheer her up. Maria, I don't know what to say. Do you have another place to stay? I don't know. Klaus is my only close friend. How can I live without him? Time heals all wounds. I'm sure he'll be out in two years. Everything will be fine. I'm sure he'll be jailed for life or even shot. No, let's not say that. Um, time heals all wounds. I hope so. Anyway, I'll wait on the court and then make my decision. I won't stay in this apartment any longer. They beat him. I saw it with my own eyes. I understand. You'd better leave. End conversation. Oh, yeah. You probably should leave. Now I got to fill these apartments. And, the, and these people down here won't stop reading, uh, doing th bad things, trying to get us killed. Okay. Um, hello. Furniture repair. Is there... I'm here on business. I need to repair the furniture in the apartment. Come in. Okay. Oh. I need to... I need stuff to repair the furniture. The furniture repair kit. I'm gonna need a whole mess of these. Oh, this is... This is too much. Oh, and I need some of these, too. Where? What the hell happened? Oh, she's packing up. She's leaving. Okay, I repaired that. Oh, because it's abandoned now. Oh, look at that. Look at that. All right, well... She's gone. Can I? I can't go in here unless. Oh, I can't go in there. Oh, wow, that's something. That's a mess. That's a whole mess. All right, I should probably go and repair my own place where my wife has a fit. This is this is off. Oh, hang three banners in the hallway. Do I have banners? I do. All right. Can I put the banners? Oh, look it. I can put the banners here. Look it. Let me put these banners up. Propaganda. Look at me hanging propaganda. Put this propaganda up. Okay. We got new directives. It's illegal to possess foreign salt. It's illegal to patronize a bar. Okay, we got that. And I did this. Okay, and we don't have any bills. Thank goodness. Okay, let's... Um... Is he here? Let's knock on this dough. He's not here. Let's go in here. Let's put a... 
Let's put some more cameras in this place. Is this the only place? Oh, let's put a camera here. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to look around. Oh, I can't until it's fixed. Whiskey. I can take that. That's worth money. Is Aloysius coming back? Oh, there he is. Here he is. Here he is. Dumbbells. Stamp collection. Those are worth some money. Let me take that. Okay, get on out of here. All right. Is the selling man... Oh, watch the selling man never come back again. Watch the selling man never come back again. All right, we need to fill these apartments up. I only got two apartments. Um... Let's see. Let's repair apartment one. And let's see who we can move in. A music teacher, 29, needs to find an apartment ASAP. It's life or death. Okay. Dora Noel. All right. We done rented it out to Dora Noel. A young girl with sad eyes. All right. What's he doing? He's on the phone. Can't really see. Okay. Um. Oh, he's here. Let's go see. We can sell this stuff. We gotta still finish the repairing the furniture. Uh, sell this stamp collection. We'll sell this booze. All right. Uh, let's go in here, knock on his door, and finish fixing his apartment. Oh, he's not there. Where is he? Oh, he's downstairs. Is he coming up? Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. He's coming up. Did that woman go down? Well, never mind. Let's go and repair our own stuff then. Oh, it's too much. Okay. Do we have stuff to repair? No. We're out of repairing. We need this. A couple of those. Gotta get some more of these. It's There's a whole lot of repairing to do. This is crazy. Gotta repair our TV for no reason. Oh, what am I looking at? No, I don't wanna look at that. I don't wanna look at that. I took everything out of our house. Let's repair the table. Oh, and I gotta repair this? Okay, so we repaired our stuff. How much more? Well, we got... Oh, we gotta go up and repair this apartment. Okay. Are you all home? I need better cameras. So this little bit of range of nothing. I ain't catching nobody doing anything. We got a new directive. It's illegal to possess and use weapons. I think they have a weapon in here. Are you all home? Oh, they are home. Coming in to just um, repair some things, ma'am. So, ma'am and sir. These are the Rainix, right? How can I talk to her? Good afternoon. Furniture repair, sir. I'm here on business. I need to repair the furniture. Come in. Okay, we'll repair this. Oh. <coughs> He's an elky. Oh, my. Okay. I 
can't look through stuff while I'm repairing it? What kind of landlord am I? Those they don't see me, right? Oh, they do see me. Dag. What are you doing here? Furniture repair. Okay. <laughs> okay, come on. <laughs> Let's leave. Okay, so what's the last thing we have to repair? It says 12 out of 13. Oh, we're still in Aloysius. Okay. We gotta go repair his stuff. Come on. Oh. He's not. Okay. Let's go in. Let's just go in. Where is he? Did he go down? He's down. Okay. Um, let's go in. What's he got? Anything? He's downstairs. He's got a passport. A book on anatomy. Isn't a book illegal? What are these? Letter openers. Let's, oh, I need a repair kit. Let's just repair this. He's still down there. Okay, you got anything? Oh, he's coming. He's coming. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, up, up. Oh, he ain't got nothing. All right, let's get out. I got a new directive. Oh, okay, I repaired all the furniture. Great, great, wonderful. All right. Oh, there's something in the mail. All right. Breaking news. Several hours ago, a series of explosives took place at the convenience goods storage facility on Krusevik Street. No one was injured. No one was killed, but 15 people were injured. The situation is under control, so there's no reason to panic. Now for the weather. Tomorrow, look for winds from the north, a high of 60 degrees and light showers. Voice of Truth. Comrades, we have spoken and spoken loud. The whole city heard the explosion. The explosions took place at the plant where state officials were planning to introduce 14-hour shifts. The government won't listen to our voice, our peaceful voices. So let it hear our cries of war. We will force them to respect the rights of workers. If they continue with their plans, we'll turn the ministry to rubble. Wow. Okay. Okay, why isn't the the dude coming to buy stuff anymore? I can't sell stuff to him anymore. I gotta, I've gotta go through nefarious means. Okay, what is this lady? I haven't met her, so is she in her apartment? Okay, let me meet her. Dora Noel, what do you want? Let's meet her. Hello, I'm Carl, the landlord. Dora Noel, nice to meet you. Let me know if you need anything. Of course. Um, ask about where did you come from? Who cares where I came from? All that matters is that I'm here now. I like it here. It's less crowded than the capital, and everyone has a job. Do you like it here? Yes. See, we have a lot in common. Ask about the news. What's new? Alas, I have nothing to tell you. I don't know anybody here. I got a cold on my first day here. Okay, and the conversation. Goodbye. All right. Um, let's see. Are these people here? Still need to get into this apartment. They're not there. That's probably them coming back. Is that them? Oh, that's probably them. Yes, that's them. Let me go in here for a quick, 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 quick like. We gotta find the gun. Tobacco. Book. Fishing rod. Oh, shoot. 
fine. Oh, they're downstairs. They're downstairs. Okay, go back in. Oh, there's the dude that buys stuff. Hiding guns and fans. Oh, let's steal that watch. And the chair. Ah. Uh. They had a gun. Oh, he's coming up. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. They had a gun. Oh, I got it. He's looking at the... He's looking at the... Okay, hurry. Get out. <gasps> okay. Um. Oh, our son... Our son wanted something, but it's too late now. Um... They had a gun. I don't know where the gun is. Can I peep through the hole? I should have put a... It's probably in that. In, the, in there. Okay. Alright. Oh, she's leaving. Let's go in her apartment. She just went downstairs. Let's go in here, see what she's got. Anything? Anything good? See, he's got a gun. He's got a gun. Rat poison. Oh, she's coming, she's coming, she's coming. She's coming, she's coming. Okay, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Let's go talk to our son. He obviously wants something. See, he's got a gun. I don't know how I can... How, how can I... Isn't there a way for me to... Oh, God. And the conversation. Can I... Can I, like, surveillance that when there's somebody's doing something? Oh, he's done with it. All that does is open my inventory. I thought if they were doing it with that... Okay, never mind. All right, we'll talk to our son. Yes, father. Um, Learn what happened. Now what? I can't bear it anymore, Dad. Another day in the mine and I'll hang myself. Oh, gosh. And what do you suggest? I want to leave the country, Dad. If I stay here, I'll eventually cease to be human. I could feel myself becoming dumber every day, and there's no way I'll ever get out of this. And where are you going? One of my co-workers told me they need my profile ex They need my profile experts in North Borea. The same profile I had at the university. I'll be able to graduate and get a good job there. North, are you sure it's not South Borea? Isn't it the same? Poor little miner. Too bad they didn't teach you geography at the university. North and South Borea are two different planets. That's not funny, Dad. Okay, how much do you need? A lot, Dad. 20000 I'll see what I can do. No, we don't see what we can do. Thanks, Dad. You rule. We ain't. We look like we got. All we got is three thousand dollars. Forty-eight hours, with what? With what? With what? Mm -hmm. What, Carl? Um. Oh God, this is too much. Klaus Shimmer was arrested, Carl. Do you know what happened? No. Um, it's none of your business, Anna. The Ministry of Order is in a better position to know who's guilty. Yeah, let's not. But how? Are they really guilty? No, I don't know. That's none of your business, Anna. Leave them alone. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, God, talk about Martha's death. Okay, give me back Martha. Yeah, I know, we, we didn't do this. So, well, okay. Um, how may I help? I $700 for utility bills. Just give it to her because we don't have time for this. Thank you, Carl. You're awesome. Okay. Anything else? Talk about Patrick's immigration. Do you know Patrick wants to leave? Yes, he told me. He's really upset about having to give up his education. What do you think? Shall we help him? My heart is breaking, Carl. They'll kill him at the border. They'll shoot him like a dog. My poor baby. I need to talk him out of it, but he won't listen. Oh, gosh. All right. Affordable apartments. Lease in any apartment. Okay. We got to lease an apartment. Um... Let's do apartment number four. Let's move somebody in. A young student looking to rent a room. All right. Fud fettle. Mm, all right. Fud fettle it is. Oh, she's leaving. What about those people from upstairs? Are they? I don't know. He's leaving. I wonder if she's there. She's leaving too, so let's 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 go knock on her door. Oh no, she's in there. Okay, Fud Fettle's moving in. She's not home because she got on the bus. She better not be coming home. Let's see if we can go in here and find some things. Okay, we looked in there. Who what? <laughs> Rat poison. Is that any of this stuff worth anything? Does she have nothing? Nothing worth getting anybody on? A knife? That's not illegal? A purple blouse with a customer's name on it. Empty dirty bottles. Is that her? Oh, a watch. Oh, this is this is illegal. Oh, that's her. That's her. Illegal. Coming out. We got illegalities. Oh, <gasps> get on out. Okay. Illegalities. Um. All right. Illegalities. Can we blackmail her? Let's see if we can blackmail her. This is, I don't know, I don't know. Let's try to, let's try to, um, let's try to blackmail her. Let's try to blackmail her. Dora Noel, she lives in apartment one. Um, what is it? The 80s music? What does she have? Evidence. 80s music, right? Let's see if we can get some money out of her. Or if we turn her in, though, do we get more money? Okay, first let's profile her. Do we get money if we profile her? Or do we have anything to profile her with? Okay. She, oops, she's female. Uh, she lives alone, and she's a music teacher. Oh, we get money for that, for profiling people. Okay, so let's write a report, because I think we get money for, write, for writing people up, don't we? Listen, these people got to go. Should, wait, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. First of all. First of all, let's think about this. Let's think about this strategically. Okay, if we blackmail her and then find something else, we could keep blackmailing her? I don't understand how this works. <laughs> we got, look at this money we got to come up with. Look at this. This is ridiculous.
This is ridiculous. Um. So if we blackmail her. You know what? Maybe we can. Maybe we should we just report her. We probably get more money that way. We probably get more money. I'm just going to test it out. Just report her. We'll just report her. We'll just report her. Okay? We'll write a report and see how that works. Because we did the blackmail last time. It took forever. It took forever. Um, the 80s music. What is that? Directive what? 6046. I can't even see what the date is. That the 16th? 6046. 6046. Um, no, you got to put the date that it was on. It's the September 6th. And yeah, 80s music. Send it. Okay. This poor girl. Here come the popo. -po. They're gonna beat this poor girl down. Who's this? George Danton. Listen, this poor girl is getting ready to go to bed. She ain't done nothing. She's just a music teacher who loves herself some 80s music. And I done turned her in. All for some money. So, so wrong, Lisa. This is so wrong on so many levels. Yep, there it is. Meanwhile, he up here with a gun. This is wrong on so many levels. Oh! Oh! Wrong. Oh, wrong. Girl, I'm sorry. Well, I got a family, and I already done lost one child. Who are you with a pirate eye? Oh no, my phone's ringing too? Except the private car. Hello, this is Carl Stein. With whom am I talking? You've heard about the National Labor Lottery, right? It's winner. Leo Vezdek is looking for a place to stay. We want you to give refuge to this lucky man. What good will that do you? Who are you? Well, we're well-wishers. He'll soon face a thousand temptations. Bandits and frauds will be wanting, waiting for him around every corner. We want to help. After he moves in, you must convince him to invest his winnings in, your produ in our production. Our Horns and Hooves Trust benefits the science of breeding and caring for farm animals. We help farmers sell every part of an animal carcass. They don't waste a thing. We send the meat to the stores and the skins to the shoemakers, and we use the rest for preparing the proprietary jelly, jellied meat. Ugh. Jellied meat? Do you not like jellied meat? How can one say? <laughs> Consider this a warning, Carl. If somebody stands in our way, he becomes jellied meat himself. Soon our jellied meat will become a national good. Ugh. All you need to do is convince Leo Vezdek that the future belongs to our jellied meat. Vezdek? Yes, but who thinks up such names? That's a real tongue twister. Persuade him to invest money in the Horns and Hooves Trust. If you do that, we'll give you a generous, por a generous portion of what he gives us. Great. Oh, I'm in it. This I'm, I'm too far in. I'm too far in. I'm too far in. Okay. All right.
Do I gotta? Oh, I get nothing for for uh getting her kicked out. Oh, because it wasn't a thing. Lisa, I did all that for nothing. I just got two hundred and fifty dollars. <gasps> well, I will be doing that again. Okay, Leo Zvezdek is the winner of the annual labor lottery. He has faithfully served his country for 20 years without a single violation. He is the pride of the state. The prize this year is 100000 Remember, every citizen we're with more than 15 years of work experience can take part in the lottery. Voice of Truth. People with more than 15 years of work experience can take part in the lottery. What does this that tell you that Leo and his companions in misfortune spent decades working hard and paying crazy amounts of money to the labor lottery fund. Each of them could have saved 40000 over the course of 20 years. Where did the rest of that money go? Can the lottery administra administration tell us that? <laughs> okay. All right. Who are you? Get acquainted. Hello, Carl. Who are you? A new tenant? I know everyone who lives in the building, but this is the first time I've seen you. We don't know each other, but I hope we become friends. My, no, my name is George Danton. How can I help you? I made inquiries, Carl. I think you're a decent man who can be trusted. After that, I want you to do me a simple but important favor. What should I do? A young man, fiddle fiddle burk check. <laughs> lives in your building. Can you give him this box? Why don't you do it yourself? I have reasons. You'll know them after you do me the favor. There's only one condition. Do you not open the box? Are you trying to get me mixed up in something illegal? Aren't you afraid I'll report this to the quarter? Fear divides people, I assure you. We have opposing goals. The only thing you need to know now is that we'll pay a good price for this case. Very well. Do you agree? Take the box and give it to Fiddle Faddle. Take the box and bring it to your office. Turn down the deal. Oh, God. Oh. <sighs> what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Um, oh my gosh. I'll take the box and give it the fiddle faddle. Well, the money won't hurt. Give me the box. Thanks, Carl. We pay our debts. Yeah, I've heard that before. Okay. All right. So what is this? Oh. oh, was this the stuff that was in our apartment? Oh, I can take it and I can sell it. Okay. Wonderful. All right. Um, Let me pause this because I got to... Okay, give this box to Fiddle Faddle. Um, I need to move in Leo and find money for Patrick. I got 22 hours. Okay, so let me move in Leo. Okay. Um, let me see. Can I move in Leo into one of these apartments? Can I repair this apartment and move in Leo? Okay, here he is. He urgently needs to rent an apartment for a few days. The closer he is to the factory, the happier he'll be. Well, floor one. Okay. Where's Fiddle Faddle? What apartment is Fiddle Faddle in? Is this Fiddle Faddle? He's in apartment um, four. Is he up here? Is this Fiddle Faddle? No, nope, that's the good vegetable. Okay. Let me see. Can I give this to Fiddle Faddle? I don't have any cameras at Fiddle Faddles. Okay. Okay, if this um, saves, then I can uh, quit this long, long, long.
whole episode. I had no idea this game was this this crazy. Okay, fiddle faddle. Okay, we haven't met him either. Hello, I'm Carl, the landlord. Fiddle faddle, a student at the university. Um, ask about the name. Ask about the university. Let's ask about the name. My father picked this silly name. Okay, my mom calls me full. I don't like that either. Learn what it means. Now, end the dialogue. Okay, let's talk to him again. Um, ask about George Danton. He rescued me. Other than that, all I can tell you is my life would be completely different if it weren't for him. Okay. Uh, we'll give him the box. I was asked to give you this box. Perfect. Danton wasn't wrong about you. Here's the money. Then I'll move out in a couple of days. It's time for great deeds. Okay. Ooh, excellent. Perfect. Okay. Nice talking to you. Talk about the university. What's your specialty? Chemistry. It's a nice university and such. We chop up different frogs and then mix them, mix some shit in flasks until it bubbles and smokes. I see you don't find what you're studying to be inspiring. I just don't understand how chopped up frogs can help me to become a person who can make the world a better place. Okay. In the dialogue. All right. Um... I'm assuming that task saved. So, we're going to end this episode here. And we have some things to do. I don't know if we're going to save our son <laughs> from whatever fate he has. Because he wants to uh, leave the country. Because that's a lot of money. And we're not making a whole lot of money. I don't know how you make a whole lot of money in this, in this game. Might have to look that up. But um, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, give it a like. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do that. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section down below. And that is it for this video. Thanks for hanging out. I will see you all in my next. Bye-bye.